Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. This is Sunday Omni. If you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing and be sure to like this video as well. Also, don't forget to turn on the notification bell. This way you'll be notified every single time I upload a new video on my channel. So in this video, we are talking about talk show host Wendy Williams and new information that's come out regarding her health from her team, the executives, um, and they are saying that Wendy has to delay um, the premiere of her talk show until Monday, October 4th, because allegedly she has the Rona and she's been exposed to, you know, some breakthrough cases. Um, I personally don't believe this. You guys comment down below. Let me know your thoughts. I have a feeling like there are some serious things happening with Wendy behind the scenes, but they're just trying to buy more time. All right. I feel like these are, I'm just being honest. I do believe that in my opinion, there's just, um, they're finding some excuses to prolong and maybe Wendy's getting some therapy and, you know, getting some detoxing done or something along the way. I'm not sure, but I just don't really buy this. I had a feeling that Wendy probably wouldn't return back to her show after the last message that we received that she was canceling all her promotion and stuff for her show and now that they have prolonged everything until monday october 4th i think it's because there's some other real you know some other things that are happening i don't think it's just um the fact that she tested you know positive for the rona or been exposed to any breakthrough stuff because most celebrities if they don't want to go to the hospital they don't have to and wendy has her own personal doctors that could see her at her um, apartment, you know, as well. So she did not have to go anywhere if she did not want to, I don't think, right? I believe that maybe she's going to some facilities and some other things are really going on with her. But I believe that these executives don't want to cancel the Wendy Williams show because there's a lot of money, you know, on the table here. And there's people, there's staff, there are people counting on Wendy and her recovery. But I believe that there's other real serious health issues that she's also dealing with, maybe on top of this one. But they are trying to see what they can do to buy more time and to be convincing to the Wendy Williams show fans as well to still keep people intrigued and interested in her and on the show because the longer Wendy stays away after some time there's you know a new talk show might show up there might be more competition or people will forget about her so they also have you know a duty to let us know but also let us be still interested in Wendy but this is just my opinion I look forward to hearing what you guys have to say but I don't believe that this just has to do with with this whole Rona situation. I don't think that this just happened just now. Um, I just, I don't, I don't buy it, but I would love to hear what you guys have to say down below. I wish Wendy all the best, you know, um, according to allegations and her former DJ, DJ Booth, he said there are serious things happening with Wendy's health and the concern is serious. And he has witnessed and seen a lot of things when he was working there that nobody even wants to talk about. So there are people who are enabling Wendy. There are people who just want Wendy to be back at work and they don't even care, I think, about her health because she's worth lots of money and they're counting on her. And it's really sad, but let's just be honest. Uh, Wendy should just focus on loving herself and taking care of herself and focusing on her self-care because there are people, I think, that are also using her along the way, sadly. All right. But would love to hear what you guys have to say down below in the comment section. Be sure to connect with me on Instagram as well if you're over there at Sunday Omni. And if you'd like to support me, get your copy of my ebook. It's called More Than Good Enough. Until our next conversation, bye.